I was Gucci today. Fine. I, I, was you sick or something? No, no. I was, <laughs> how, how do you evaluate how you play? Austin, I told you on the phone the other day, I'm not into commenting why guys play or they don't play. I, as he continues to grow, he'll play. If he doesn't grow, he won't play. It's, uh, I'm pretty simple when it comes to that. Guys mentioned the zone was a little tough, that it didn't seem like they had any tendencies with what they were trying to do defensively. What uh, what were you looking at um, from the high post offensively? It looked like you were trying some different guys at that spot. Well, Jamar gave us six assists. Yeah. You know, and uh, that's when, when the, the thing that happens with post guys when you play a zone is post guys are no different than everyone else. They're in there sealing and posting and banging away. And they want the basketball. And if they don't get it, they get frustrated. It's no different than a shooter coming off screens being open and people not throwing on the ball. Against the zone, though, post guys have to be extremely patient because if you throw it in there at the wrong time, you're putting them in harm's way. Uh, you're putting them in a situation where it's going to be hard uh, to succeed because of the way that the zones are played. And um, I, I think in the second half, we did a better job. Uh, we, we didn't. With not being able to practice as much during the week, we couldn't practice or, or get as much repetition on as some of the things that we need to get repetitions on. Uh, Southern Miss and Gardner Webb didn't play us any zone. Uh, Oregon played us very little zone. So it's something that we haven't faced in a while. And early in the game, we kind of did what the zone wants you to do, which is kind of stand around and shoot the basketball without really attacking. <coughs> uh, as the game continued, uh, we didn't do a great job but we did a better job of moving the basketball. And then, like I told the guys in the locker room, uh, offensively, the one thing we did do was we went and rebounded it on the offensive end. And uh, we, 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 I think we created some separation in the game because we did that. Coach, where do you see this team right now? I mean, going into this holiday break, I mean, we've got uh, three more non-conference games from the Big 12. What do you need to improve on collectively and improve uh, in the season? Some of the things that we were just talking about, uh, because of how we play, it's very important that we continue to, 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 to get as many repetitions. And, and if you're a team that doesn't get extended defensively or doesn't run on offense, uh, it's like a football team without special teams. Um, you only got to practice offense and defense. You don't have to practice the other stuff, which we, we incorporate that aspect of the game. So we got to spend a lot of time in practice working on that. Uh, and then. Our set defense, uh, obviously today we weren't real good. I think we need to, uh, we need to have a change up for our man-to-man -man defense uh, with our some kind of zone. So we, we're going to have to uh, find one there. You can't get people out by throwing 98 miles per hour all the time. You got to have that, uh, that something a little different sometimes, and, and we got to get better at that. Uh, and then our, our set half-court offense, uh, that, that's something that, that we need to continue to work on. We got, we got young guys. We got guys that uh, uh, continue to, to learn as their roles are defined as to when to shoot, when not to shoot, what to look for. And I think we're getting better at that. And we, we, we definitely got to continue to get better at that, at those two things in particular. Is this an important game today because you had battle, I mean, more so than like when a game where everything goes right against Gardner Webb and, you know, the payoff later because you had to kind of battle through uh, when you guys were struggling a little bit? I'm just happy the game's over. Yeah. I, I, some guys, I like not having practices. I lose my mind when, when, when I don't feel we're preparing the right way uh, to go play a game. So I, uh, it was good to see our guys uh, stay the course. You know, we, we continued to battle. We, we obviously didn't play well early in the game, and uh, we, we didn't have guys lose focus and, and, and lose desire. Uh, we were sloppy in how we played, but I get back to the same thing. That's, uh, that's due because of time constraints, we kind of had to prepare that way. And uh, uh, like I said, we you, you got to find what you have to do every night to figure out a way to succeed. And tonight, we obviously weren't very good offensively. We were average defensively, but we rebounded the basketball. And uh, I think they had no offensive rebounds in the first half, as bad as we played, yet we cleaned up the glass. And then on, uh, we got on that offensive glass. And like I said, that we missed some shots that we've been making. Uh, but we were there to rebound them and, and create fouls and, and get some putbacks to create separation. Thank you, guys. Have you guys have a good.